Hey there, bee lovers. Big Dan the Bug Man here. Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're diving into the fascinating world of bees, specifically focusing on those buzzing around Northeast Ohio. From honeybees to sweat bees, we'll cover everything you need to know about identifying these incredible insects and their unique behaviors. Let's get started. What are some common types of bees found in Northeast Ohio? In Ohio, you'll typically encounter honeybees, bumblebees, carpenter bees, mason bees, leafcutter bees, sweat bees, digger bees, and mining bees. Each of these bees has distinct characteristics and plays a crucial role in our ecosystem. How can you identify a honeybee? Honeybees are generally golden brown with black stripes. They're about half an inch long and have fuzzy bodies that help them collect pollen. You'll often see them around flowers, working diligently to pollinate plants and gather nectar. What is unique about bumblebees? Bumblebees are larger and fuzzier than honeybees with a distinctive black and yellow coloration. They have a robust build and are excellent pollinators, often seen buzzing around flowers in a clumsy yet charming manner. Unlike honeybees, bumblebees can sting multiple times and are social creatures living in small colonies. Where do carpenter bees typically nest? Carpenter bees are known for their ability to drill into wood. They prefer unpainted or weathered wood surfaces where they create tunnels to lay their eggs. If you see perfectly round holes in wooden structures around your home, it might be a sign of carpenter bee activity. What role do mason bees play in the ecosystem? Mason bees are solitary bees and excellent pollinators, especially for fruit trees. They use mud to construct their nests in small cavities, such as hollow stems or cracks in walls. These bees are incredibly efficient, often pollinating more flowers in a day than honeybees. How do leafcutter bees construct their nests? Leafcutter bees are fascinating builders. They cut small circular pieces from leaves and use them to line their nests, which they often build in pre-existing cavities. This leaf lining provides a protective environment for their larvae to grow. Are sweat bees attracted to human sweat? Yes, they are. Sweat bees are small, often metallic colored bees that are attracted to the salt in human sweat. They're generally not aggressive, but they might give a mild sting if provoked. You'll commonly see them during the summer months. What is distinctive about digger bees? Digger bees get their name from their nesting habits. They excavate tunnels in the ground to create their nests. These bees are usually solitary and can be identified by their burrowing behavior and the small mounds of soil they leave at the entrance of their nests. How can you differentiate mining bees from other ground nesting bees? Mining bees are typically smaller than digger bees and have a more delicate build. They often nest in sandy or loose soil, creating intricate tunnel systems. Look for their distinct burrows in garden beds or lawns during the spring. How to identify if I have a bee infestation? Signs of a bee infestation include seeing a high number of bees in one area, finding multiple nests, or noticing structural damage from nesting activities. If you suspect an infestation, it's best to contact a professional pest control service, like Prevent Pest Control, to safely and effectively address the issue. There you have it, folks, a comprehensive look at the bees of Northeast Ohio. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit the like button, share it with your friends, and subscribe to our channel for more fascinating content about the natural world. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video.